I'm literally trying to pay as fast as possible so that they don't sell out. Alright, good. Ready to go. Sunday, 12-18. Yeah, we got it. Babe, we got it. Got what? The, the breakfast sandwiches. Good. Yeah, they're not sold out. We've been trying to go to this place for breakfast. Oh, good morning, by the way. This is the first clip I'm filming. We vlog mistake, 19. Um, we've been trying to go to this breakfast place. Wait, what? Visa ending in 7735? That's literally not my credit card number. I have no idea where that just went. Whatever. I don't know who just paid for that. My credit card is not 7735. I don't have a visa. Don't think that's my credit card either. Well, someone just paid for our food with the 7735. Whose number is it? I'm not that. I'm not either. It expires next year. I have no idea. Maybe I'll check my cards. It might be mine. I don't know. Who else's well, card would be in your phone? No one's. It's my Apple wallet that's connected to my bank account. That's so weird. Anyway, whatever. Last, no, two weeks ago, last week, I don't know. We tried to go to the bagel shop. They were sold out of bagels. So we went to Dunkin', I think. And then ever since then, I've been wanting a breakfast breakfast sandwich. And today I just ordered them. I got a pork roll, egg, and cheese on toasted everything bagel with a hash brown on it. And you got a sausage, egg, and cheese toasted plain bagel with a hash brown on it. Should we go? Can we go to Starbucks? Sure. We gotta, we're going to Caesar in like 12 to 12.30. Yeah. So let's go get this stuff. I'll do it. Come back, eat, get ready, go. Sound good? Yep. Let's go. Go where? To pick up our food. All right, you aren't moving at all. Because you're like on TikTok. Don't you have things to do? Don't you have to brush your teeth? Oh, fuck. I have to put in my contacts. I'm yelling at him. But I have to put my contacts in. Hey. Hey. I have to put my contacts in. Are you excited for your morning? Yeah. Me too. Uh, Are you excited to go to sleep? Yeah. Me too. <laughs> Hands up, little lady. Oh my gosh, what the hell? Can I get Starbucks? Joa. It's just a frother, it's not really gonna hurt you. It might if there's a stray metal edge. Yeah, but it's not. I'm so excited for my breakfast sandwich. I've been really craving one for a while and it's absolutely packed inside. So I'm really glad we placed an online order. He's already got it. F yeah. Now we're gonna go to Starbucks. We're going to his friend's house today and I'm meeting his friend's girlfriend. So um, I wanna look like cutie, you know what I mean? I'm so happy we got these. You wanna smell them? Oh, I smell them. Mm. Oh my god, I can't wait. So I guy held the door for me and I was like fucking 30 feet away. Oh, it's the worst. <laughs> then you have to like, like run. thanks, brother. Then you have to like literally run. Yeah. Oh, I thought someone wrote a heart, but it was just a square. 30 feet on square. I really don't know who paid for these because that's not my credit card. And it's... Who would be one of my credit cards? But why would I have your credit card saved in my phone? I don't know. I don't. I don't know. The only credit card I have on my <sighs> phone is... I thought this guy was going to drive right into you. Yeah, who knows. Look at all those spots. Why is no one parking there? I have no idea. This person needs to figure the fuck out. Probably because it's by the front door. Look at this sweet worker. Oh, because all the signs are down. Right over there. That girl looks freezing. I don't blame her. That's me. Freezing? I hope everyone at Giants okay. Oh, that's nice. Oh. Wait. No. This like is. That. I could do this, right? Yeah. This is a 2XL. Are these. Oops. Are these for kids? Oh, they have bills, though. Wait, are these for kids? I have no idea. Well, I should hold it because this is like the only thing. I could fit. I could fit in this, right? Yeah. 2XL. No, I'm not getting Steelers. Wait, there has to be another section. This is most definitely for kids. Is this even cute or is it just the only thing that they have? 
There's nowhere else in the whole store. Oh no, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Will you like? I don't know either. Can we walk that way? What? Let's walk this way and then GTF. So then, do you want to go that way? My current order is a matcha latte with um, vanilla and oat milk, and it's so good. Everyone's wearing eagle stuff. You okay? Yeah. What's mine? Same stuff on Facebook. Um, What's that? What's that I go that way, right? I go all the way that way and then left. Um, no, go this way. Right. Oh, heck yeah. Okay, I'm actually gonna eat this at home. Look at that. It's beefy boy. Oh, yeah. So excited to eat this. No, it's gonna be crummy because it's an everything bagel. I'll eat it at home. He hates crumbs. So courteous of you. I know. So Target had that thing, but I wanted um, a t shirt. That one was kind of weird, right? Like, it was kind of weird. Has my hair looked like. Has my hair looked like this the whole time? I don't know. <laughs> Have you seriously let me walk around looking? Are you kidding? What do you want for Mike? Like to tell me when I look crazy. What do you think? It's like a white turtleneck, long sleeve underneath with ripped jeans and white Converse. Cute, right? That's what I'm thinking. That was the vision anyway. These things feel freaking hefty. Yeah, these are some thick boys. Thick boy? Karma is your boyfriend. Look at that. That is a good looking breakfast sandwich. Mm. Look at this with the hash brown. No, you got one with the hash brown too. <laughs> Wow. Just playing around. Mmm. Wait, let's watch Night at the Museum. We didn't watch that. I fucking love Night at the Museum. Oh my god, a hatch brown on breakfast sandwich is so elite. This takes the cake. This is number one for me. Better than shore break? Yeah. Not me. Yeah, croissant. It's not fair though. There's no croissant? No croissant. But that automatically makes it not the best for you. Yep. Losers. This number one. Short break number two. Manhattan number three. This is the shirt that I just bought. This white top is from Threads. Um, I showed it a couple videos back, like a week ago. My mom and I went shopping. So that's Threads. It's just like a crop, it ends like right here. So, and then these jeans are from um, these three boutique. And yeah, so that's my outfit. And I film whenever like I do my makeup, but I don't film like any chatty portions so I felt like maybe we could just like chat today um the other day I used the milk hydro grip primer it was fine I'm gonna use it again today it's kind of sticky but I guess that's the point it's also really freaking cold out today lately I've been using the Charlotte Tilbury light wonder foundation and i like it a lot um and like on days that i want like a flawless base i mix it with the giorgio armani luminous silk foundation and that i also really like but today i'm just gonna do charlotte tilbury i don't want anything too crazy but i feel like my face is like kind of pale 
right now so i'm probably going to add some cream bronzer to really warm it up um the Giorgio Armani is like definitely darker. I could also use that to warm up my skin, but I don't want to do anything like too orange looking just because like my hands are a dead giveaway. Lately for contour, I've been using the Rare Beauty contour stick and I like it. It's pretty good. I feel like I don't really know what to update you guys on because we talk every day um lately i've been using the nars orgasm cream blush i really want the rare beauty blush every time i go to get it it's sold out of the color that i want so i just haven't ever gotten it so i'm gonna try the milk one remember they sent me this i hope that's not too much i guess we will see oh yeah no that was not too much if anything i could do much more but yeah yesterday's vlog was like really really short just because it was such an uneventful day like even though it was our anniversary we just wanted to like chill all day yesterday so we really didn't do anything so it was probably really boring to watch and i woke up and i was like should i just combine it with today and then I was like, no, because it's probably going to be like at least like 10 to 15 minutes, which it was like 13 or something. And today I knew we'd be doing like just more stuff. And I woke up at a normal time. So this is Tarte Shape Tape. Do they still make this or do they not? Because I searched for it the other day and I couldn't find it. But I have a hard time believing that they discontinued that. But let me know. Um, so yeah, we're meeting up with some new friends. This is, um, his co-workers. Well, this is his one co-worker and his co-worker's girlfriend. So I've never met, I met the co-worker like very briefly in passing last weekend when I picked my boyfriend up at the train station. Um, and so I met him like very briefly then and like a couple times on the phone. But other than that, I haven't like really officially met him or hung out with him and I've never met his girlfriend. So meeting new people today. And so with that being said, I don't know how much I'm gonna vlog when I'm there. Cause I don't wanna be like a weirdo that's vlogging when you meet someone new. So I'm not sure how much I'm gonna vlog. Um, so if it's not much, forgive me, but they did get a new puppy. So like literally yesterday they picked up this new puppy. So I would like to vlog the puppy. Who doesn't want to see a new puppy? And I can't wait to meet this puppy. Oh, I know what I want to talk about while I'm doing a chatty get ready with me, channeling my inner Alex Earl. What the heck is Art Basil? Basil, Basil, I have no idea. I have literally no idea what it was. I've never heard of it before once in my life and it was apparently the place to freaking be. What is it? That's it, like what is it? And I guess because this isn't in real time, I won't get the answer right now. Okay, now I'm taking this NARS Duo in the shade Sol Isolide, I don't know. I'm taking this gold bronzy shade and I put that on the outer half of my lid love this color love it so much this nars duo in alma Hafebra. i don't even know and i'm taking that on the other side of my brush and then just flipping the two back and forth to blend them i take mac jumbo shadow in white and just do a quick swipe. If you do too much, it like gets way too white. Either done. And I spray with Morphe setting mist. And that's my makeup. Okay, final outfit. Yay. Hello. 
sorry, I have not vlogged since earlier because I wasn't gonna vlog at her new friend's house. It wasn't the vibe, I was not just gonna whip out my camera and vlog. But they did have a puppy and she was just like everything of the sort. She was so cute. She was a King Charles Cavalier and she's eight weeks old. Like literally she was so tiny and she was just perfect, absolutely perfect. Um, yeah, but now we're headed back home. We're gonna go finish Night at the Museum. I wanna oh, take, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I wanna take off my gel nail polish so bad, so I think I'm gonna soak as we watch that movie and then just plan a little bit. Okay, so the way that I take my nails off is I use, um, well, first of all, I just have on gel nail polish. I use pliers and I rip them off. Yeah, that's one way. Oh, I forgot my cuticle cutters. So on my nails right now, I just have gel nail polish and there's a little bit of acrylic on my nails from when I got them done randomly a couple weeks ago and then I took them off like five days later because I hated them. So there's a thin layer of acrylic. But if I were doing my nails on my own, I would dip my nails in um, a thin layer of dip powder anyway, so that which is acrylic powder, so that they would, whatever, have a little bit of layer on them. Mm -hmm. But this is just gel with a little bit of acrylic on it. So what I do is the first thing is I just take a nail file. This is a 100 and 180 grit. I use the 180 side and I'll link this like my nail kit down below. Um, and I just buff off like the shininess. I'll just show you on this one. So I try to buff off the top layer of gel polish. I mean, you could technically buff off all of your gel polish with this nail file. I don't like using an e-file, so I prefer hand filing, and I just buff off the shiny layer of it. It just takes a little more time and elbow grease, but it gets the job done, and then you can see that it will kind of get through to your natural nail. Just so that I'm not super harsh on my natural nail, or I guess that this isn't natural because I have a little bit of acrylic still left. Oh, but if you had long nails, I would cut them down first, but I'm gonna cut mine afterwards because they're not like super long or anything crazy. And I do this technique with everything, with like acrylic or like gel, like no matter what's on my nails. The only time I don't do this is if I have regular nail polish on with no like extra product underneath, but that doesn't ever really happen. So I buff it till it looks like that. And then I just take, um, I got this at CVS. It's just pure acetone. This one says pro nail polish remover removes gel nail polish, lifts away artificial nails. So make sure you get one that is strong enough for artificial nails. And then I soak the pad in acetone, wrap my nail in it, and then I use these things. You can use um, tin foil or like aluminum foil. And then I just let that sit on my nail for like 10 minutes. And I'll show you what I do when it's ready to uh, to come off. And I'll show you the final steps. Yeah, we're going to watch Night at the Museum as I, uh, as I do this. So I'll just time lapses. And I'm eating some frozen mango as I do this too. I'm really hungry. Okay, so then after the nails have been soaking for like... Mm, 30 minutes. Well, I've been taking them all off. So this is the last one. So you just take this off and then it looks like this. Like it's pretty much ready. So I just rub it. And this one is coming off pretty well. So I don't need to do too much work. But then it likes to like stick in a couple spots. So I just grab my file and buff the remaining polish off. Then I'll just go through and cut my nails, shape them like this hand I've already shaped. And then I just take a buffer and I buff all of my nails smooth and then I'll wash them and then just put cuticle oil on them and that's how I take off my nails. <laughs> Hold 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, hey, Jay, stop that. Problem, huh? Why can't you just get along? Look, we're men. We fight, okay? That's what we do.